Hey guys, and welcome back to Surviving Mars. Well, we are uh, currently trying to survive Mars. Send it in the tail. It's just a thing. Uh, what buildings aren't working? Storage space is full. All my factories malfunctioned. Okay. That's okay. Yeah, I mean, we just need, we need more metal. That's the main thing. Alright, getting some more drones. I'll just pull down around here. And then. Uh, uh, uh. But the main thing you're doing is loading that up. I should probably also get some more. Dumping sites around here. Mission controls received a direct Ooh. communique from ESOCorp, one of Earth's largest tech conglomerates. Please be advised that Object 6. <laughs> Please be advised that Object 6EZ3 will be operating within a respectful distance of your mission. You are not to approach Object 6EZ3 under any circumstance under threat of legal and other punitive measures. Nothing further was added and no effort to even mimic adherence to standard protocol guidelines was made. Our Earth partners are given their best to question ESOCorp and get to the bottom of this. Who do these guys think they are? Alright, hopefully we'll get to the stage where this is no longer heavy load. Sector right, scan. Back around here. Yeah, I pulled people off of that and people off of that so that we could get more machine parts, which is fine. And we're still getting. Some electronics. There's some machine parts as well. Some electronics up here and some machine parts, but... The main point is just to be able to repair everything that's kicking about. But these guys are still doing great for food. Um, which is keeping these guys kinda stocked up. Right. Why is these guys? Do you care that you're working at night time? No available service building for gaming and okay. As long as they can still like as long as the the birth threshold's still high enough, funding then I don't really care. Right, there's the funding. Keep forgetting that. I'm just bring, just spend thirty million on a drone. Why not? I think like, uh, food's only twenty. Bring down some food, some fud. Now I'm probably just going to get that to uh, to come up here and just go back and forth. Yeah, see that loads low. Oh, I mean, it does have 20 drones. Pipe leak report. Object 6EZ3 has Ooh. made impact on the surface, not too far from base. Our readings suggest it's intact and operational. So far, we can deduce it's only patrolling the area as we can't detect uh, sophisticated scientific, uh, science instruments from this observation range. Landing, however, was seen by some of our colonists and questions are being raised. Questions we can't currently answer. Our Earth partners have so far fallen short from picking up on any new information and are currently preparing to take the issue to the UN. Soon we have to take things into our own hands. Where'd it land though? That's what I'd like to know. Right, I suppose it's not really an issue. Ooh, a new anomaly. 
exactly what I need. Lightning doesn't strike twice in the same place twice, but meteors might. Anomaly found. Ooh, another one. And another one. And another one. That's good, because that'll get his rover printing a bit quicker. Yeah, I'm going to land him there. I'm going to face it that way or something and just get them to, uh... It's probably up to 10 on that guy. Right, go and then analyse that an anomaly. Actually, go and... No. No. What the fuck are you doing, dick? I just land a rocket on top of it. If you're analyzing my analyses, I'm not going to be happy. Um, right. I would like a fuel depot there. And a rare metals depot there. Alright. Now you can just do your thing. Do your thing, honey. It's all shit here. Sector scan. Oh, <laughs> you just got scudded. Right. Let's let it go. I'm I'm really interested to see how this plays out. The one that we did have was like a, an AI thing, and that didn't really it didn't really get to through fruition on the stream, which was unfortunate. Oh, we've got storage spaces full. Fair enough. Meteor incoming. Oh, we analyzed the anomaly and uh, we're getting closer. We're getting closer. Vehicle battery low. That's fine. All right, are you going to take off? get him to do a full load. Make it a bit quicker for the uh, the drones. Right. Pipe leak reported. Time flies. The hey. the final mission evaluation is drawing near. It's oh no. a good time to look at the colony statistics address any goals and issues that we haven't so far. Oh, we need 80 and we've got 87. Oh, sweet. Nice. Yeah, these people don't really care. No, no, they do care about working during the dark hours. But what if we go to... Ah, there's something I actually wanted to check. Take one concrete, but they give bits of light, so 
wonder if that'll make people happier about working during the dark hours. Maybe not, maybe it's just literally for light. Just for the sake of it. Alright, he's, uh, he's heading up. What I could really do with is the... Get some social. Received. Live from Mars. I give you Martian patents. It's it's not really not worth it actually. Well, let's get Martian education because then I can put the an education place in there. Okay. Alright, we're slowly but surely getting our stockpiles back of everything that we need. So that's Resources good. Resources are low. Yeah, we're low on machine parts. But I think that's because we just got above the threshold for it to say that and then we just went below it again because it's night time. You're not working because storage space is full and you're not working because storage space is full. Okay. It's a good problem to have. Research complete. Hey, we've got rover printing. Sweet. Uh, right. Production. Oh no, it's not. We literally just copy paste them, don't we? So we'll get them placed and I'll probably use up, you know what, no let's, let's not do all of them, let's just do one more rover. Sector scanned. The main point of it is so that I can get more research. You don't want to use too many electronics. Resources are low. Machine parts and food. No, we're not low on food. Uh, I want you to come down here and load up on metals, please. Yeah, these guys are kicking ass with these prefabs. I think I get you unload them. Thank you. I'd love to see what this guy's actually doing. I'll just leave it. I was gonna go and poke about. We're actually doing decent enough for research, but yeah, I need to I need to plow along social to get the research using the excess. Is that social or was that a breakthrough? I cannot remember for the life of me if it was social or a breakthrough. Yeah, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get you, my friend, to come up here, and we are going to build some sensor towers sector okay. scanned and you are going to grab me all three of these electronics come down here to do that you I don't care about because you are literally just here Um, for research. So we're now getting 180.
Wait, we're getting 180, but each of them are losing. Oh, okay. Funding received. I thought. I... What? I could have three electronics for you. Or did someone nick them? I think someone nicked them off the back of them. Fucking drones, man. Right, let's remove that. It's not really needed anymore. Here. complete e biome engineering and that's gave us microgravity medicine which I don't care about I'm gonna get micro manufacture and don't really care about that I mean maybe it's better than a farm maybe I should check out that because if it gives us more space then it could be could be worth it but I doubt it it's cheap enough anyway just to grab. We detect and monitor four more Aha. objects as they parachute down and make landfall. Every one of them bearing a resemblance to object 6EZ3. Isocorp is totally silent about a second batch of what we believe to be some sort of surveying rovers. More colonists have witnessed the landings and are openly concerned about what they perceive to be an invasion. Calm them down, we need answers. Aren't working. Storage space vault. That's fine. Sensor scanned. Sensor scanned. Sensor scanned. There we go. That would be a good idea to, to shove some a bit closer to this section. Right, there's 30 there, just ready to be thrown in. Oh, we are actually short on food. Well, that's not great, is it? Well, maybe we do need something down here. Even if it's just a, um, even if we just remove that and put down a hydroponic. Oh fuck it! Look at them. There's loads of them. Bloody everywhere. Sector scanned. Oh fuckers. Uh, right. Just keep scanning, just keep scanning. We're going headbutt this one. Have a food shortage. Yeah, we've actually got a decent amount of electronics again. I was going to say I don't know how we've uh, how we're doing so badly on food, but I do actually. Good yield, but slow growth. Okay, that's all we need. How are we doing here? We've got three unemployed people. Okay. 
So let's open up another shift at another factory. Uh, but unfortunately, guys, it looks like that's all we've got time for in this episode. So as always, thanks a lot for watching. I've been Steve, you've been awesome, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.